All new tonight at 11, the fall from grace for an American soldier turned convicted criminal. A federal jury finding Xavier Boston guilty of running a sex trafficking operation in Charlotte over several years. Prosecutors say he targeted vulnerable young women who were addicted to drugs. All of this coming to light after we highlighted him on a happy occasion in a recent news story. NBC Charlotte's Alex Shabbat is following the latest developments for us and joins us live. So Alex, this is a real shock to the whole community here. That's right, Sarah. We actually saw a hero's welcome for him as he visited his daughter's classroom. That was just last year. But tonight, a dramatic turn of events. This surprise entrance lit up his daughter's classroom in 2017, but tonight we're learning of a dark twist in Xavier Boston's life, now trading in his uniform for a mugshot. And instead of being described as a military hero, federal prosecutors calling him a predator. The former soldier convicted of running a sex trafficking operation in Charlotte between 2012 and 2017, except for a brief time when he was deployed overseas. We were there as he celebrated a return home. The care packages and the, the support and the things that people send you, it, it, makes the, it, makes, uh, it makes the deployment easy. All the while, federal prosecutors say Boston had recruited victims who were all struggling with drug addictions. The U.S. attorney says he, quote, preyed upon young vulnerable women, exploiting their drug addictions and forcing them to engage in prostitution for his own profit. Authorities say without the drugs, the victims would experience excruciating physical and mental pain from withdrawal. And Boston withheld their drugs until after they completed commercial sex acts. Prosecutors said, quote, Xavier Boston promised his victims a better life. Instead, he robbed them of their civil rights and freedom to make a profit. Now he will pay the price. After a three-day trial, Boston was convicted of one count of using an interstate facility to promote a prostitution enterprise and six counts of sex trafficking. And each count of sex trafficking comes with a minimum of 15 years in prison and a maximum of life in prison. So far, no date yet for sentencing. Live in Uptown, Alex Shabad, NBC Charlotte. It is mind-boggling. What a story. Thank you, Alex.